Hello everyone, welcome back to my High Celebrities News Channel. The story for today is Emily Sande has revealed the identity of her partner after announcing that she had entered a same-sex relationship with a female pianist following her divorce. The singer, 35, shared a pair of loved-up snaps with Joanna Karamuva, which saw her beam from ear to ear and stare adoringly at the musician. In her caption, she confessed her soulmate had given her me the strength she needed and feels like a huge weight has been lifted after opening up to her fans. She penned, it's taken me many years to find the strength to be myself, I've struggled for a long time to accept myself as I am. I'm so lucky to have found my soulmate Joanna, she's such an extraordinary woman. Falling in love with her gave me the strength I needed. Feels so good to be in love and I feel happier than ever. I'm deeply touched by all your messages of love and support, thank you so much for your acceptance and kind wishes. Feels like a huge weight has been lifted, here's to a new beginning in truth and happiness. One heart suit. She recently told Metro, we met through music, and I definitely feel happier than ever. It feels great. The read all about it hitmaker confirmed her divorce from marine biologist Adam Gurigwan, who she dated for more than a decade before exchanging vows, in 2014 after just two years of marriage. Of her new relationship, she added, for me, true love and having love in your life makes everything fit into place. If you don't really have someone to share it with or someone supporting you behind the scenes, it's very difficult. So now I feel very fulfilled, he'll always love music and I love my career but now it just feels that despite what happens, I can just enjoy life and be really happy. The singer's revelation comes after she unveiled the video for new track There Isn't Much on streaming platform YouTube. The promo features a troupe of female dancers drafted in from the gay community, but Sande admits Shush is uncertain when it comes to putting a label on her own sexuality. I'm not sure what I identify as but I guess sir, she said when asked if she considers herself to be gay. I just feel like I should fall in love with whoever I fall in love with. The singer previously claimed she came close to suffering a breakdown after splitting from her childhood sweetheart Adam Gurigwan, who she dated for 10 years, and admitted she was still coming to terms with losing her best friend. Emily, who married Adam in his home nation Montenegro in September 2012 told The Times in 2014, everyone thought it gone mad. What do you mean a divorce? We were all at your wedding a few months ago. But there was just something inside me that said, this isnt the life. You're pretending to be someone else. She added, I don't want to call it a breakdown, but it felt like that. The singer was believed to have taken Adam's surname to make her own double-barreled, although remained as Emily Sande for her pop career. Speaking about her Montenegro-born husband in 2013, she said, I would also love to have a Montenegrin passport. I want to be part of his tradition, I grew up in a family of two different cultural backgrounds, so I embraced both. One day when we have kids, I'd like them to be the part of these two different cultures. That is all for today news, please make sure to leave your comment and subscribe the channel below for more news update. Thank you for watching.